We had uh, a blast looking at um, actual uh, creatures that live on the planet that you've never seen before and sort of using them as an inspiration and a basis for biological authenticity. Hi, Tori. Hi, it's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you so much for your time. My pleasure to be talking to you and to talk about Monarch. It's, oh my God, I was like on the very scary moment and very, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I was like, I want to, I can I, I couldn't stop watching. So oh, fantastic. That's, yes. So what attracted you to this project? What, what what was about that that script that 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 the story that attracted you? Um, well, we, uh, Matt Fraction, have been starting to develop the project with Legendary, who's our fantastic co-creator and, and lauded comic book writer. Um, Joby and I, who's my producing partner and husband, we've both been able to step in the ring of big pieces of IP and big spectacle. And we've also done smaller TV shows like Underground and Spinning Out. But it was really fun to actually bring both of those worlds together, where you get to have 10 hours of character-driven story, but also in a world of big spectacle and big expectation. Um, and so we um, we came on board and we helped sell it to Apple TV Plus and then you know put together the amazing team that put it turned it into this robust family drama that you see and you know all the things we love about it. Yes, all the, the timelines, like different timelines, all different characters, and sometimes I was like. Oh, okay. This is happening now. This is happening now. In the beginning, the first episode, I was kind of like confused, but then I pick it up, <laughs> and it was amazing. What was like the biggest challenge is to keep that pace, like because all the episodes are kind of have a good pace, a good like interesting story. I think that you know we we always wanted to deliver on the expectation of the monsterverse and really you know have it feel like a robust. Uh, globe charting adventure that was full of the monsters you know and love and new monsters that you'll come to love but we also really felt like this is an opportunity to have authentic human relationships that you really fall in love with these characters that you're really with them and heartbroken with them and falling in love with them and so it was it was always that fine-tuning that calibration so that we're really achieving both at an a level that we were constantly trying to keep ourselves honest to make sure that we we're doing that and the monsters oh my god they are like amazing what was like the, the i know that is we already saw Godzilla before, it was based like in some other good Godzillas, but what was like the main inspiration for the monsters? Um, well, you know, we obviously, we love our hero, uh, Godzilla. He's, you know, he's, he's it was so amazing to be able to work with that Titan. He's um, an amazing actor. We're so glad, he's not on strike with the rest of SAG, but we, uh, which we really appreciate. But it was fun, and de the development of, of new monsters, it was, we had uh, a blast looking at um, actual, uh, creatures that live on the planet that you've never seen before and sort of using them as an inspiration and a basis for biological authenticity. So a lot of the things you see in the show are actually, you know, it, um, you, you can look behind the curtain and find out that there, there's something that, that exists like that, that we've just built on top of that. So it always feels there's some dimension of reality. It's not just pure fantasy. There's always something authentic underneath. Yes. And what do we can expect of the whole series from Monarch Le Legacy of Monsters? Um, we, you know, it's something that we, we hope that this is going to be a show that is going to win the hearts and minds of people. It's not just for hardcore fans. This is a show for everyone. Um, and we hope that people will tune in so that we can continue to play in the sandbox. Amazing. Tori, I just want to thank you so much for your time. A pleasure to meet you. And I just want to say that I love spinning out. Oh, thank love you. It. Love it. Love it. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank Bye. You. If you like this video, don't forget to comment, to like, and subscribe to our channel right here.